What do you know about sleep paralysis or what people call demons or witches riding your back? Again, we've covered this question in hmm. terms of sleep paralysis many, many times. Um, that deals with when you're kind of like coming out of your body. Yeah, so you've got your, you've got your different parts of you. Um, you've got your physical body, you've got your spiritual body, you've got your mental body, the, you know, the plasmatic you, the etheric you. And normally is when there's a disconnect between the physical you and one of your other, you know, spiritual beings. So um, sleep paralysis is when you hear the word, you're asleep, but you're paralyzed. paralyzed yep. So but you're asleep, you're, you're supposed to be asleep, but you're awake and you can't move mm. because your, you know, your other essence that connects you with the physical body is not there at that moment. So a lot of people will travel when they go to what they call sleep. Um, and travel to different realms, come outside their bodies. There are people who they say they've had a near-death experience or they might be in an operating room in a hospital and their body comes out, um, sorry, their spiritual being mm. comes out and they're actually watching their body being operated on. But the body's just still. Um, and sometimes you do it when you go to sleep and then you wake up before you fuse back together. Mm. And that's where that moment before, you know, you come back together as one. Um, it's happened to me. Mm, yeah, <laughs> you're, it you're just scared because you're like, what's going <laughs> yeah. on? I'm awake, but I can't move. Yeah. And then you, some people f get frightened, but you have to just relax, breathe, mm. and then after a while you will come back together.